Hey guys, I am back. I am here on a little like peninsula island type thing. It's called Gooseberry Island, I guess. I just looked it on the map. It's a cool little area. I guess there's a long path here that goes all the way to the end. I've never even been over here before, but I have been over here on the beach. If you look back on one of my videos called, uh, I think it's called like Fire in the Sky. Really cool video I made. Um, it was actually right over there. But um, other than that, it was, I came here really in the mor early in the morning, but I, I didn't come down this way. I don't know what's down here. Maybe it's a lighthouse or something. I'm going to check it out. Um, it's a really nice day out today, so I figured I'd get out of the house and do something. Uh, my friend, Trevor, from the last vlog, might meet me down here. But I don't know. I haven't heard back from him. So we'll see. As I'm walking up on this tower thing, I don't know what the hell this is. Maybe we can go up top. Maybe we can go inside. Go all the way up. Hopefully it's not like gross and dirty in there. Oh uh, no, you can't even get in. This is a metal door. And there's a cage right there. Oh no, it's not a cage. They tried to weld it shut, but somebody obviously broke it off or something. But you can actually get in there. And there's a rock like holding the door open a little bit. But you can't get in there because it's too heavy. And then there's this thing. What the hell is this? These look like, uh, like ports or something. Maybe like during the war or something, the ships used to come and they used to sit, they used to sit in the bunkers or whatever they're called, up top just to spot them. Let's see if we can get in here. Beach. It's a little bunker or something like that. Nothing to it. Snap a few pictures. Alright, let's check that place out. I'm just uh, I'm just uh, chilling out by this little nice spot over here. A bunch of rocks. I'll probably get a few photos over here. Um, some some long exposure pictures. But if you guys didn't already know, my drone is modded. Um, well, I already told you. If you watched the vlog, if you watched the last vlog, I told you that my drone was modded. But basically, what it basically what it does is I can fly. So DJI, the company that builds makes these drones, they try to lock you out of. Um, basically limits yourself kind of like what Apple does with the iPhone I don't want you to jailbreak it and all that but what this company does is it locks you out it's kind of for safety reasons but not so much it's they like, basically the drone is only allowed to go 500 meters which is 1600 feet um, but the FAA law is 400 feet you're not supposed to fly above that because of uh, regulations or whatever but the drone can can fly higher than that it just the, the company just caps you out at uh, 500 meters but these, this unlocking, this unlocking makes it so you can go basically as high as you want. So I think it caps out at 3,000 meters and then it automatically turns home. But you can do something to make it so it, um, it, it goes above that. But you can go as high. I just went 3,000 feet. Um, so the most you can go, which is 500 meters that they cap it at, is 1,500 feet, I think, or 1,600. Um, but I just went 3,000 and it was pretty high. Um, you don't really ever want to fly that high because you can't really see nothing unless you're trying to see something or whatever that you can't normally see that's close to you. Um, but I've seen pictures online um, and videos of them going as high as 10,000 feet, which is crazy. I want to get a video of me like flying th through the uh, clouds, which would be really cool. Um, it also lets you go faster. Um, I think it gives like a, if you're in sport mode, it gives it like a 10% uh, 10 miles per hour boost. So normally it would be like 40, uh, 30, 35 miles per hour, but now it can go 45, 46 miles per hour in sport mode. And also, if you take it out of sport mode, usually it goes a lot slower. But now, if you this, this it's called GPS Plus mode, where you can take it, it goes about 10 miles per hour faster, but it still has those slow cinematic shots. But with sport mode, it has like the jerky motion. So 
it's pretty cool. Um, what else can it do? It um, this, these things called no-fly zones. So if you're next to an airport or a national park or a restricted area or, or somewhere where you're, where it's not supposed to, a stadium, somewhere where you're not really supposed to fly because they lock you out, um, you can now fly anywhere you want. Um, now I don't recommend you doing this because people are just stupid and just be smart about it. You don't want to go fly next to an airport. There's really no point. I seen a video of some guy flying right next to a plane, which is stupid. Uh, I obviously would never do that, but I would like to like fly over a stadium or something. Um, you're not supposed to fly over over things with a lot of people, but I wouldn't fly over it with a lot of people in it. I would just fly over it when nothing's going on. But there's a bunch of stuff this uh, this thing can do that they uh, unlocked, so it's pretty cool. So that's if you want to know how to how to mod a drone or hack it or whatever, just uh, post in the comments below, and I will happily help you if you're going to be smart about it. But I'm just going to sit here and relax and look at this ocean. I am at 2,000 feet right now and rising. I'm about to bring it up to 3,000 feet. It's insane. And I just hit 3,000 feet. I'm gonna leave it here because I don't want to go any higher. I'm getting a little nervous. But this is what 3,000 feet looks like. Crazy. Let's bring it down. Well, I just got home. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I just tried to get out, um, get a little, a little footage for you guys, some cool footage for the drone. Um, but I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Um, subscribe for more videos. And we have a hater lurking. I don't really use the word hater, but we got a hater lurking. Every single time I upload a video, 
um, I get that one dislike, like right when I upload it, it's a one dislike. So it's, it's obviously somebody that is subscribed and has notifications turned on. Um, and then, yeah, they keep disliking my videos. So whoever that is, thank you for hating my videos. You keep giving me views. So thank you for subscribing. Um, yeah, let them hate. But thank you guys for watching the video. I will see you in the next vlog. This is the life of Marley.